This is the TLKR T80 Extreme Walkie Talkie. I did a video on this back in uh, 2016 where it was just an unboxing, nothing more than that. But today I've driven 190 miles to do a range test of this. I want to see, not how it's going to perform in kind of, uh, you know, built up areas. We're going to do a, a, a kind of a full maximum range test, line of sight. How far can this go? It's just a standard PMR446, half a watt output, but it's into uh, a monopole kind of coiled rubber duck essentially. And the, I don't know whether it's half a watt actual output or whether it's half a watt from the antenna itself, but either way, we're gonna try it out. And this is where I'm gonna to travel to. This is the River Dee out across here and in the distance there you can see North Wales and I'm going to essentially travel about 39 miles around the coastline and go right over the other side there. It'll be about 10 kilometres and we'll see whether or not we can talk to each other on this. The other person who's going to help me by the way is the person who's filming at the moment, that's Will and uh, he's going to be on the other end trying to receive me. A lot of effort to just try and prove a simple fact. Can these actually do 10 kilometers? Something we forgot to mention in the introduction there is the location that we were at just then is uh, the Thurstaston Wirral Country Park. It's down by uh, uh, the coast and it's uh, next to the Wirral Way and that's pretty much all I know about it. But yeah, it's Wirral Country Park. And uh, I'll show you on a map now. I uh, appreciate that people watching this, you know, you won't necessarily know this area of the UK at all. So let's do a kind of nice zoom in from the earth and uh, zoom in to the UK and to the northwest of England and into the Wirral Peninsula and you can see the exact spot there where we were just then filming. And the place where I'm going to now is uh, in just, just near Hollywell in North Wales, so over the River Dee in North Wales uh, and I'm going to go up Penny Hall or Penny Bal, I'm not quite sure how you pronounce it. Uh, it's just a hill that uh, turns left, you know, it's a road that turns left and hopefully just goes up and gives us a nice clear takeoff point, clear line of sight over to the Wirral Peninsula. My sat nav says it's 22 miles. I feel like it should be more than that, so hopefully the pin that I put in the sat nav, the location I put in the sat nav, is right. So I've just had a call from Torsten, uh, who's over in North Wales in position, so I'm just walking back down to the front and we'll see whether they work in a minute or two. So let's give this a try. I'm going to do this one handy because I, I, I was going to set up a tripod, but uh, then I thought against it. So let's try this and see whether it works. It's uh, five out of five, over. <laughs> excellent, excellent. That's the result we want. What a great signal, I can't believe that. It's worked fine. So, that's, uh, that's that then, really, isn't it? <laughs> you don't even need that. I haven't got the uh, squad turned off. It's, uh, it's, just, it's on at the moment, it's absolutely fine. <laughs> 10 out of 10 Motorola, 10 out of 10 Motorola, fabulous. So just, just to re-emphasize the point, this is a uh, line of sight distance test. 
about 11 kilometers. Actually, we said 10 feet, but we could get to like 11. Didn't want to scare, uh, scare Will off. <laughs> and uh, line of sight over there, over the River Dee, to Wirral Country Park from uh, Hollywell in North Wales. I'm well impressed, that's all we can say. Well done. Problem is, I, I, I had this uh, additional location there, thought, uh, kind of in my head, uh, to, to make it kind of 14, 15 kilometres, but <laughs> I just can't be bothered now. Um, well, I, I, I'm, I'm easy this end, it's a lovely view, it's quite a pleasant evening, so um, as long as you get back before it gets dark. Yeah, the traffic the other way is not too bad. Uh, it's the traffic into Wales that's a bit of a problem today. It's a bit slow going, but not too bad. And make your way over the uh, Cluidian Range southbound, please, towards uh, the uh, towards the Bristol area. Yeah, that's about, that sounds about right. Is that a dog in the background? Yeah, it doesn't seem to be barking at me, but it barks at everybody else, which is unusual. <laughs> I'm just trying to work out where you are from here. Have you got your motor vehicle uh, facing um, facing towards the Wirral? Over? I have, yes. It, it is. Wow. Maybe I'll lie. Maybe it does bark at me. I take it you're videoing this? <laughs> yes, I am, yeah. <laughs> Brilliant. Maybe I'll get uh, 250 quid from you being framed as you get bit to death by a dog. <laughs> well, you think I'd be this calm? It's behind a gate. Uh, I, I was just thinking maybe you could put your lights on full beam and uh, there's a chance. Oh, I doubt it. I, I, I'm not even sure where you are. Um, I think where I, the car's at too, too low a level, you see. It's kind of blocked. I've had to walk up the, up the track a bit. Yeah, that's it. That's, uh, I think you've got a fair idea where you are. But no, I'm, I'm, I'm really, really pleased it's worked. Great job. <laughs> nice one. Catch you later. I should be back in about half an hour. See you in a bit. Thanks for that. See ya. Well, perfect result. I didn't expect it to be that good. 11 kilometers, line of sight, no problem at all. Fully charged batteries, of course, but you know, you'd kind of expect me to do that. Yeah, really good. I know how. Nothing. I f I play music and I smoke a little grass now and then.